Hey, it's Chris Love of the Information Lab. I'm back with the Good to Great series of blog posts. It's been a little while since I posted, but after holiday season and uh, catching up with a bit of work, then I'm, I'm rearing to go again. So let's uh, focus on something that comes up relatively often um, in my experience, and that's working with colour and wanting to encode on a dimension and a measure. It's useful to have this little trick up your sleeve when you want to do that. Let's set up a common situation. I've got the some data here from Superstore Sales, and I'm going to just encode on country to produce a map, and let's change that to a field map. And I'm going to encode by the region on color, which is a dimension. That's going to give me the different colors that I need just here. I'd also like to show the number of sales, but that's very difficult to do. I can't use size because it's a field map, and I can't use colour because I'm already encoding on region. So what do I do? Let me show you a little trick. So I'm going to duplicate by holding down control and duplicating one of the measures in my rows or columns, and I'm going to turn that into a dual axis. So we've now got two measures across the top of each other. Let's come down to the second one of these. Take region off colour and drop sales onto colour. I'm going to come and turn down the colour on here, the transparency on here, till it's around 40%. And I'm also going to change this to a grey. Look at the effect of that. We've now got the encoding still on dimension, so we've still got this orange, blue and green. But we also have the depth of colour showing the depth of the sales within each area, within each country. Really nice trick that we can also use on bar charts. Let's do it on a bar chart. I'm going to bring in region just here. Let's again use country. And let's use sales for the bar length. And I'd like to split up my areas into coloured regions, just like we had before. Now, if I want to encode profit, I'm going to do the same again. I'm going to duplicate the sum of sales, create a dual axis, change my mark types back to bar, and I'm going to synchronise my axes just to make sure they fit. Now then, on the second one, Pick up profit and replace region. And then the colour on here can go to grey. And again, it can change to 40% transparency. You see the most profitable areas represented by the darker colours. Colour encoded by the dimension on the second axis by region. That was all I want to show you, just a really quick way of encoding by a dimension and a measure using colour. Hope it's been useful. Thanks for listening.